Hi there, I'm Justin Kempinen, and today we're going to be making a pumpkin cheesecake. The ingredients that you're going to need will be some graham crackers, light or dark brown sugar, three eight ounce packs of softened cream cheese, four large eggs, heavy whipping cream, butter or margarine, sour cream, all purpose flour, granulated sugar, a 15 ounce can of pumpkin pie puree, ground cloves, ground nutmeg, ground cinnamon, and vanilla extract. All right, so let's get started. All right, first let's get our oven preheated to 350 degrees. We're gonna start by making the graham cracker crust. For that, you're gonna need one and three quarters of a cup of ground up graham crackers. One of these packages just happen to be just enough, so it'll probably be the same for you. So we're gonna uh, dump that in. And also three tablespoons of the brown sugar, along with half a teaspoon of cinnamon. And then half a cup of melted butter. All right, so now we're just gonna go ahead and mix this up until it gets to a uh, consistency where it all looks pretty much the same. All right, next we're gonna take a nine inch spring pan right here and take the graham crackers and go ahead and line them all around the spring pan. This is what your crust should look like once it's spread all throughout the bottom of the pan. All right, next we're gonna take our three eight ounce packs of cream cheese, and we're gonna blend it and soften it until it is smooth. This consistency should be good for our next step. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and add our one can of pumpkin puree, 15 ounces of it. and one and a half cups of sugar, four eggs. We have a quarter of a cup of sour cream we're adding as well. A tablespoon of vanilla extract, eighth of a teaspoon of ground cloves, half a teaspoon of cinnamon, and an eighth of a teaspoon of nutmeg. All right, so let's go ahead and whisk this all together. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and add in my flour, which is two tablespoons, and go ahead and mix. All right, our filling is ready. We're ready to go ahead and put that inside the crust. All right, here we're pouring it on top of the crust. So you wanna take your pan and go ahead and knock it a couple of times to make sure you get some of these bubbles out or else the top of the cheesecake is gonna crack. And in the oven it goes for one hour at 350 degrees. While that's cooking, let's go ahead and make some whipped cream for the top. All you gotta do is take some of the heavy whipping cream and pour it in a bowl. and just whip it up. And there's the fresh whipped cream that we'll put on top of the pumpkin pie cheesecake once it's done. It's been an hour, so now we can go ahead and take it out of the oven. And let it cool for 15 minutes. After it's cooled, wrap it with some saran wrap. and put it in the refrigerator for four hours to chill. Now you're just gonna use a knife and cut around the outside edge of the cheesecake to unstick it from the side of the pan. Next, open up the pan. And there you have it, your beautiful cheesecake. Who's ready for a slice? 